Welcome my beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I am Chef B, make sure to stay subscribed down below. So we're about to install this unit from lovemehere.com and I wanna show you what the wig looks like straight out of the package along with some of the stuff that you can get on the website like a wig cap and also this very cute bag that has a little edge brush, it has accessories and all that good stuff that you will need to melt your wig. Now the unit that we'll be styling is their trendy mix brown curly cut hair and this is 100% human hair with a side part. Now you don't have to worry about bleaching the knots because it's already bleached for you and also it's very unique with the parting. So it only has one style of parting so you can't necessarily do a middle part which also makes it for an easy wig install because you don't have to worry about getting that super super flat melting because we're about to do a glueless install with this unit so i did wash the hair before i style it and i also want to mow down the parting so i'm just going to repart the hair make sure that everything is nice and straight so I'm gonna take some mousse and rake it through the hair. Now I didn't experience any shedding with this hair. Once it's dry, the hair is super full. So don't let it fool you by how flat it's looking right now while it's wet. Because I'm gonna go in with my diffuser later on and you're gonna see the volume in this hair. So this is what the hair is looking like once it is dried. So I just did the drying with the diffuser for about 20 minutes to get it to full dryness. And then I'm gonna go in with the hot comb just, just to mold the hair back a little bit in the front because I wanted a lifted type of look. And also to get that parting to be flat. I like my parts to be super flat and effortless and this hair came in 10 inches so it only comes in 10 inches like you can't get other length because it's supposed to be like a short type of cut so i'm making sure that everything is laying how i like it and with this i'm going to tighten the band in the back because we're going to wear this glueless we won't be using any glue spray nothing like that we want this to be super easy and effortless where you can wear it on a daily it's your super easy drag on and go type of wig so I'm just trying to make sure that everything is aligned, everything is fitting tightly and snug. I'm adjusting the combs and the clips on the inside just to go around my ear so that it lays flat and nothing is looking bulky on the sides. Now once everything is aligned, I'm going to go in with my scissors to cut the lace. And as you guys can see, I'm doing a little motion with my scissors. I don't want to cut it straight across because when you cut a straight line with your lace, it makes it pretty obvious in pictures and in person. But once you do that zigzaggy up and down type of motion with the, the cutting, when I say effortless, I mean effortlessly laying flat. And again, we won't be using any glue or nothing like that. Now, I think I have a slight obsession with the soup to do. Like, I really didn't need to do it with this wig, but I'm like, I need something. I need a little vroom, vroom, vroom. I need a little soup. Nothing extra, nothing big, but just a little something, you know, just to, just to make it a little bit of razzle-dazzle addition to the unit. So this is what it's looking like. So I'm just gonna clip certain areas. I had a little curly hair here and there that was a little bit longer than others. So we just wanna make sure that it's framing my face nicely and everything is just right. So this is what the unit is looking like. Let me know what you guys think about it. And because I didn't do the ball cap method, because you know we're lazy girls over here, like we like to just put on our wigs and go. I'm just gonna go in with some bronzing powder just to darken my wig cap because it was a little lighter shade and also making sure that it's blending with my complexion, especially since I'm wearing makeup. I wanna make sure that everything is flawless. So when I take my pictures or you come too close to me, it doesn't look too obvious 
that um yeah we know we're wearing a wig but we don't want it to look too too obvious like the more undetectable it is the better and this is the final look let me know what you guys think about this unit all the details will be in the description box below don't forget to subscribe to the channel follow me on all major platforms and y'all already know how to do like the wig is absolutely giving I love you guys so, so much for watching. Go on, big up on yourself. Bye, guys.